So, hey, look, guys, this is going to be a great day. Uh, they gave me the microphone again. I don't know why. But look, I just want to encourage y'all. The rain really sucks. There's no way around. We all facing the same adversary, okay? But what I want to do today, let's start our day right. Let's all remove our hats and let's pray. And, and we start our day by giving God the glory. So uh, we put him first in everything we do. How about that? Awesome. Father God, we pray today that you give us an awesome day, Father God. That you, everyone that lights their fire, everything goes right. Father God, you go first. That there will be no, no adversary that we can't outcome today, Father God. We put you first. We ask you to bless everyone here through the storm, Father, and on the way back to their house. Father, we, we bless you, Father. We honor you today. In Jesus' name, we all pray. And everybody says amen. amen.
So, uh, we've got you this nice uh, oh, custom that, harvester man. smoker. Very nice. Look at that. Got that boy out. Oh, yeah. So you can hang your wrist in there. Ah, oh, beautiful. Sweet. So, so this is uh, long hair. Yeah, <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah, we can put some long hair on it. That's not a problem. Got a little bit of hair down here. Yep. Right, right in there. Good Thanks. Birthday. Happy birthday. Thank you. Happy birthday, man. <laughs> You gotta sing it. Happy birthday to you. You got a birthday to you. Yeah! Happy birthday, dear Ryan. Happy birthday to you. Thank 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 you. But it's a little bit rainy out there, but it is my birthday, so I know some of y'all brought me a present. I'll, I'll see y'all in a minute, all right? Uh, look, lots of smiles. There's definitely some teams out there that's going to need some extra help, some extra tents. Uh, but hey, thanks for making my birthday a, a special day, man. I appreciate it. And thank y'all for being here. It's going to be a heck of a show. The showdown tonight, be prepared, because I'm going to put on a show that will be unforgettable. Uh, we just got to make it there. And, uh, hey, check it out. Happy birthday to me. Okay, we have a knot platter. Okay, so first thing we're going to do, all of you are going to draw a poker chip, a chip out of the bag, and they're numbered on there. So once you draw your chip, then I'm going to go through the rules, and then we're going to line up here, and then you get to choose a pork chop. You get to choose one on the first pass, and then once you get one, then you're going to change order. So what's that mean? Instead of going one, two, three, four, five, we're going to go 15, 14, 13, 12. Look at that. I told Daddy I got a chip. Come over here and hold on to your chip. Don't go away. You're going to get two. That's right. Sauce is fine. Any way they want. Just six or six. Okay, so we'll get that. Okay, so we'll get that. Woo, what a mess this morning. Yeah, how, how about this, huh? Look what a this. mess. I'm going to get him out of here. He's got his cluster. Oh, welcome to the competition. Oh my goodness. Yesterday, we were eating crawfish down here with a crowd of people having a lot of fun. Today, everything's washed out. Let's take a look at the bayou. Overnight, rains came out of the north, the west, the south, and there you have it. I see you, Tony Satchery's truck is yes, sir. still above water, but barely. We had to back it out a little bit just to give us some dry space, but we're fortunate we're inside a truck. A lot of people out here in the weather in the tent, um, but we're ready to go. Uh, we're glad to be here. We're doing, uh, we're sponsoring the event, but we're also competing in both categories, the steak, uh, ribeye, the strip. Um, we're doing turkey and we're doing ribs and we're we're getting ready to go. Well, good luck on your uh, competition. Are you doing anything inside your truck here today? We're doing Cooking? just about everything inside the truck today. No. All right. Well, this has been quite an evening full of rain, but y'all are used to this because y'all from South Louisiana. That's right. right. We get it, uh, you know, every 20 minutes that so you don't know whether it's going to rain or not. You know, so, they yeah. say if you wait a while, it'll change. That's right. That's right. All right. Well, good luck today. Thank you. Thank you, all. Appreciate it. Well, yeah. well Milton, how y'all doing with all the rain? Man, we're making it. We uh, we just kind of adapting and rolling with it, and uh, we got a little river rolling through our operation. And uh, I, I see uh, you're punches. on high ground right now. <laughs> yeah, we, we got we got lucky with our real estate here. Yeah. Now, what are you going to be doing today? Uh, we uh, signed up for every category, so we got uh, ribeye, New York strip, ribs, uh, turkey breast, and uh, bloody marys. And I see you're uh, charred. Yes, sir. Y'all from Ocean charred. Springs, huh? From Ocean Springs, yeah, came out to the shed, come uh, first time out here, so we'll try it out. So what do you do, do down at Chard? What do y'all serve? 
Uh, we have uh, really good steaks, uh, plenty of oyster seafood, uh, pretty much covering the board of Mississippi Gulf Coast seafood. And, All yeah. right. Well, good luck with the rain and the competition today. Thank you. When we put them in there, they were full. Cool. Morning. Yeah, good morning. <laughs> Are y'all part of the competition? Yes, sir, we are. Yeah. We're with what Parts of Texas Grilling Team. All right. Well, how'd you make out with last night's rain and storming? We are Thanks all good. So you're still on high ground, right? We're still on high ground. And what's your name? I'm Kathy Pullen. Hey, Kathy. And how about you, sir? I'm Ronnie Pullen. I'm the other half. And I where y'all from? from? I am from Porter Connor, Texas. Well, good. Well, it don't rain much there, does it? No, it doesn't. <laughs> all right. Well, y'all enjoy it and good luck. Thanks. Did y'all lose a tent? Yeah, we got several. Several tents? Well, it looks like you got something replacing ours. Is this the one you had? No, this is the one we had that oh, ripped. Yeah. It ripped in the middle there oh, okay. on the roof. Well, I'm glad you're able to salvage something. You're still going to yeah. be back in business today? Oh, yeah. We went to um, Harbor Freight and got a couple more canopies. So. All right, so you just adapt them. Yep, Very adapt good. and overcome. What y'all serving today? I'm just okay. doing steaks. Thanks. All right, where y'all from? Uh, right outside of Baton Rouge. Oh, well, you know, you know about the rain, huh? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Well, anyway, well, good luck today. All right, thank Oh, well, you. what's your name? Robert Irwin. And who you at? Papa? Papa Joe's is uh, one of my teams. I won the first year shed here. All right. Well, in 2019, good luck today. I won it all. Yep. All right. That's why it fell in. But mine will fit it. Well, that was a heck of a thing last night. Did you get uh, wiped out? <laughs> <laughs> The storm now, we were good. All right, you're good. Fine. All right. Well, I'm going to talk to these folks here just for a moment. Good. Well, after last night, how's your move? Good. We're doing okay. Luckily, it's yeah. flooding and raining like crazy, but we're good. Yeah, we're good right. shape. And you're Sunny. I'm yep. Sunny. And I'm Jeff. And Jeff. Yep. Yep. And y'all are Mood Swing. We're Mood Swing Barbecue. barbecue. Yep. Well, uh, what are y'all cooking up today? So we're doing everything. We're doing everything. we're doing turkey breasts. We're going to do some uh, pretty fancy creative turn-ins with the turkey breasts. We're going to make some armadillo eggs out of them. Wrap okay. them in bacon, fill them with goat cheese and some jalapenos. Yep. Then we're going to do ribs. Uh, we're going to do the ribs here on, on this uh, pit we got over here. Well, that sounds good. It looks like y'all fared well. Your, your shop looks clean and prepared. Yeah. We are. <laughs> the the go. tornado We've came got the through. Whole whatever family yeah. through today. Right. That's right. Anyway, well, good luck with it today. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. Hey, trying to move that thing? Yeah. Is this way you want to leave it? Yeah, we're going to get it. That's the remnants, huh? Yeah. I talked to you last night. Yes, we did. Yeah. How are you? Yeah, I'm doing good. What was your name again? Ed Riley. I'm hey, with B&B &B Charcoal. Yeah, how did y'all fare with this? I see some of your uh, tents. Some tents, the yeah. I mean, I put some tents down and some tents are up, so they got theirs working, but I think these guys over here need a tent, so I'm going to right. go see. Oh, yeah. <laughs> y'all still back in business, huh? Oh, yeah, All yeah. Right. We're not good. cooking, so we're just trying to help people get uh, get back on schedule. Hey, that's so, terrific. Very that's, good. All right, well, thank you much. The barbecue we'll community yourself. pulls together, that's, that's for sure. That's what I've seen. Yep. Very good. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Are you guys going to need a tent? I have one tent. Oh, you guys need it. I think we're going to... If we had some string, we'd be good. Some rope, try to tie it down. I got some line in my truck. Do you want some. it? I got some too. All right, sure. you tell me where you gonna where you gonna be? Right here. That's Over there. Well, I said the water's gonna keep coming up. I believe it will. That's I'll how it happens. Maybe we'll try to go up there to the front in that little parking spot. Maybe. Well, I got some rope. I got some rope. All right, thank you. Hey guys. So y'all took a beating last night, huh? Yeah, just a little bit. Yeah, where y'all from? Lost everything. Far He's from Brookhaven. Oh, yeah. Lost everything that floated downstream. Somebody Hold on, found let me come around here. Hey, I got a seat over here set up. You can use. Oh, really? Yeah. It's over there. Grab it. Go the bathroom. Okay. Here. Thank Bring you. Bring your over here. All right. All right. Well, well then, how'd you fare? You lost everything? I lost my box with everything in it, and it floated downstream. Somebody found it and All brought, right. found the Are you going to be able to get back into business today? I am. Well, very good. Not going to hold you back, I huh? <laughs> try not to. Right, very good. Yesterday, we were on solid ground. Today, Fort Bayou is overflowing its banks here at the shed. 
for this uh, April competition. Barbecue folks from all over the country here. And they wake up this morning to half the sites flooded and everybody's back in business and they're still going to have a competition today. Looks like y'all took a beating, huh? <laughs> Five dollars at a thrift store. Uh, I... Pay for instructions. <laughs> hey, you gonna get back in business, <laughs> sir? You're gonna get back in business? Oh. Yep. This right. is the fun oh, part. Hey, I know. What's fun? Wait a minute, I gotta get it. It's something from out of space here. Yes, sir. Uh, Yo. Here we go. You pick up anything yet? Uh, not yet. Not yet. Cool lightning. <laughs> Where y'all from? Moss Point. Point. Oh, well then y'all used to this. <laughs> exactly, exactly. <laughs> it's only happened like three times this week. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> three right. times. I must have lost count. Alright. Well, it seems like it every time I go outside it was raining this month. Yeah. I don't remember the last time it was dry. <laughs> Alright, well good luck on everything. Thank you. Get yourself man. back into shape. You talk about what the top of? Yeah, take it. Quite a happening, huh? Oh, look at the tractor out there. Can you see it behind me? Yeah, I see it. I'm out there. I was going to go try Justin's to catch Justin's out there. People, uh, apparently, it's not just raining. Apparently, the bayou has uh, taken over about half of the shit. So, uh, it's going to be a muddy day. But well, it looks like win. most of the people have got themselves back together. Yep. They're ready to go. They're not going to let us stop them. No, huh? No. And this is, a lot of people, this is why they invest in a trailer, because something like that happens. And they say, I'm never going to let that happen again, because you got, you know, like these guys, they're set up, they're ready to roll. Um, but you know what? A lot of times it's the guy in the 10 by 10 tent or a woman that win the whole damn thing. So it, it don't matter what it looks like. It matters what the steak tastes like. Where y'all from? Bankley. Uh, Bankley. Thank you. Well, you're used to this kind of weather. Yes, but I sir. see you had to take a swim today. Several. Just a little bit. Several. Yeah. <laughs> but you've got your uh, stuff salvaged up? Yes, sir. Actually, it's not oh. ours. We actually work for the ship. Oh, yeah. do you? We're All right. Sorry. So you're helping them out, seven. huh? Yes, sir. Well, I guess hopefully they'll get back in business. Yes, well, sir. good work, man. Y'all were hustling out there. Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. All right. I appreciate I'll tell it, you. That's yours? Yes, sir. All right. Hey, well, you're going to yes, get sir. it back into business today? Yes, sir. Oh, well, good. Yes, sir. Where are you from? Uh, Memphis, Tennessee. All right. Well, the rain's up there, too, huh? Yeah. <laughs> well, look, I know it was a tough night here, but uh, thanks to these gentlemen right here, you're back in business. They're good boys, yeah. Very good. All right. Yeah. Well, good luck today. All right. Thank you, sir. And what's your name? There you go for it. Larry. All right, yes, Larry. Sir. Is that getting the COVID shot? Yeah. You, you want one? No, not, Line with, up. A, not with a needle like that. Wouldn't feel very good. So what you doing here? I'm injecting my turkey. Make sure it's nice and juicy on the inside. It has lots of moisture, flavor. So let me get that uh, music behind me. Can't go wrong with that. Right. So you're injecting it to make it juicy. Juicy, flavorful, tender. Where Nobody from? wants dry turkey. We're from St. Louis, Missouri. Oh yeah, and what's your name? I'm Christina Fitzgerald. All right, We're with Sugar Fire. Sugar Fire. Right. This is the other half of Sugar Fire. Well, the half. <laughs> 
Yes, he had a half a chicken. I did. Oh, you were cooking on the pier yesterday, weren't you? On the what? Were you cooking oh, yeah, yeah, on the, the pier, yeah. show the, on the, the pier? The pier is gone right now? Yeah. yeah. Well, so you did that yesterday, huh? Yeah. yeah. It looks like you fared all right here, huh? Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Very good. Yeah. Where are you from? I'm from Biloxi, Mississippi. I live in Ocean Springs. As a matter of fact, I live, oh. I'm neighbors with Brad. Oh, oh nice. Yeah, so, uh, I was born on a Keesler Air Force Base. You are? Yeah, all right. 71. 71. Yeah. How about that, man? Yeah. Well, good luck today. Yeah, thank you. Appreciate it, man. Is that one of those pieces you selected over there? It is, yeah. Yeah, I think it's pretty good. I got a big spinalis here. It's fucking money right there. It's a good one. It's money, money. I don't know. What do you think? Looks good. Dinner cleaned up. Yeah. Y'all fared all right, huh? Did okay. Yeah, where y'all from? Florida. Florida. Well, it rains there too, huh? Yeah, well, we're used to it. Yeah, what's your name? My name's Vic Clevenger. Hey, Vic, what's Jimmy your name? Cartel. Be, uh, well, I see you got a bunch of peppers over there, huh? Well, yeah, we're gonna do the Bloody Marys, gonna do the turkey, gonna do the ribs, gonna do some steaks, A and B. Yeah. And my girlfriend's gonna be doing steak A. Right. Her daughter's gonna be doing the kids' coup, the kids' cook. So we've got it all going on here. Well, very good. Good luck with everything. Thank y'all very much. Well, you must have selected that over there at the saucery, huh? Yeah. Uh, what yeah. you gonna do with it? Um, I'm gonna marinate it and uh, cut it. You gonna get to eat it or you gotta give that to a judge? Um, I'm gonna give it to a judge. Alright. And what's your name? Katie. Katie. Alright, Katie, well, good luck. Thank with that. you. Well, Hearts of Texas Grilling Team, how y'all yes, doing today? We're doing good. How are you? What's your name? My name's Janet Baker, the East Texas Girl Griller. Yeah. And I'm Kathy Fuller, the Fuller Premium Barbecue, the Sweet and Sassy Griller. Right, and what you doing today? I'm doing steaks. I got ribeyes, and these are strips right here. I'm doing a marinade on them, a dry brine. And then she's got something going on with her. Yeah, I've got some turkey breast on the pit and some baby backs. And we're going to do a turkey Monte Cristo and a Cuban with those ribs. So y'all from Texas, so what part of Texas are you from? I am down by the coast off of Fort O'Connor. So, right. And I'm in East Texas by Canton, Texas. And it uh, looks like y'all fared well with the storm last night. Oh, we, yes, sir. We did really good. We did. We were prepared, dropped our tents, and wrenched it down, you know, had it batten way down, down the hatches. Way batten down. Is this your first competition at the shed? No. no. This make my third year here, and this okay. is my second. Oh, veterans. All right. Veterans, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, good luck today. Thank well, you. Thank you. You, you have right. a blessed day. Well, how you doing? I'm doing wonderful. How are you? What you got going there? I got a little steak, a eh? little wagyu ribeye getting ready, putting a little spicy white light in on it, getting ready to finish marinating. I understand this is not your first rodeo here. Uh, no, sir. We've been here for several years. For five. Well, I won a few things. We have. We've been very fortunate. Five, six years ago, we won the KCBS cook they had here. Uh, then two years ago, when they did their SCA cook, I got uh, second in steak and second in ribs and brand champion overall so i tied with the uh, first place for high points so it was a good day got some good cash good prizes and had a lot of fun now it looks like you want high ground here for the storm so we got really we got really lucky that some folks back there behind us uh, they end up having water under their trailer this morning they end up pulling them out relocating them but uh, we're on high ground got some little fence platforms out here so we're we're enjoying a, a good barbecue and a good steak cook right now good, good luck with today's competition thank you very much have a good day <laughs> Well, Scott, looks like you're wrapping it up there. Oh, you go. We're wrapping it up. We got some hot wings. All right, but those aren't for competition, then. Huh? Those are not. Those are for our for us to snack on while everybody else works. But a lot of you uh, folks here are using that grill, right? That's right. That's right. This, about this is a PK grill. This is specifically a PK 360. It's a cast aluminum barbecue grill. 
They're based in Little Rock. It's uh, rust proof and durable. A lot of these uh, competition guys use PKs because uh, aluminum is a really great material for a barbecue grill. It makes it makes the heat uh, really consistent. So that's what I saw the kids using in there. Yeah, that's our PK Go, which is our portable grill. They're smaller, so they're using them for the kids competition in there. All right, y'all from Arkansas, you said. We are from Little Rock, Arkansas. All right. Welcome to the coast. Thank you very much. Shed. We love it down here. All right. We love it down here. well with the storm. That's the, the, Yep. No, we fared well with the storm. We're partnered with our uh, uh, dealer, the Grills of Mississippi. So these guys are selling product out here today, and we're sure. cooking. So you Grills of Mississippi? Yeah, I'm Jonathan Huddleston with Grills of Mississippi. Yes. Sir. Where are you located? At? We're uh, based out of Ridgeland, Mississippi. We're a barbecue supply store uh, in Mississippi. Okay. Yeah. Well, good luck to all y'all today. Thank you for coming out, man. Have a good time. Yes, sir. All right, what's your name? Tyler. Hi. All right, Tyler. 
Good to meet you. All right, you too. Well, uh, good luck with the show. Thank you. All right, thank you. What y'all got going for competition? Ribs. The ribs right back uh, there. That right there, that that rib. there. That's our secret little uh, turkey, huh? Oh, secret. Yeah, you can't see it yet. All right, well, looks like you got your uh, your whole tent and everything back up and running yes, after yes. that disaster this morning, huh? Yeah, it took us <laughs> it took us a hot minute to get it back up after the water came up, well, but I'm glad y'all got it worked out. Us it's too, man. Game. Yeah. We were down, but never out. Where y'all from? I'm from Moss Point. He's from Wiggins. Yeah, I thought y'all told me that this morning. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. From Wiggins. Uh, yeah, I'm from Wiggins. I'm a little up north, but, you know. That's not too far. Nah. It's, it's, it's not much over there. You part of this team? Oh, uh, yes, sir. I'm part. I'm with him. Yeah. I'm doing the ribs and the secret turkey. He's going to be doing the steaks in a little bit, so. Shooting for number one. Hey, that'd be, yes, sir. Hey, that'd be a comeback, wouldn't it? Yes, sir. Yeah. This is my first competition here, too. Oh, is so. it? Yes, sir. Huh? This is his uh, third. Joining me. <laughs> Going from the bottom, hopefully to the top. Yes, sir. Well, heck, that would be a great comeback. Yes, sir. Good luck to both of you. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Hey, tell me what you got in there. I have my pork chop that I'm going to turn in for the competition. And I'm hoping to get first place. I'm about anything special with it? I took, we took some of those lines off my practice and put it on here. Yep. What'd you cook it on? This little right here. That's the PK, huh? Yep, the PK. All right. You ready to turn it in, be in first place, huh? Yep. All right. Hopefully. Show me what you got. Mason, show me what you got there. All right, boys, you ready? Uh, it's all done, huh? Is that yep. a first place winner? Yeah, this is. Yeah, how about yours? Mine. Yeah, we're a team. Oh, team. All right. So you got to get to the judges, right? Yep. All right, good luck. <laughs> it's a meat bouquet. <laughs> that is it. What, did y'all start on that yesterday? Yeah, pretty much. Thanks <laughs> well, for the extra I ain't hour. half of it, so she had to start over. That was a problem. Yeah. Well, that's a miracle. Huh? All right, I'm starting to feel the burn. This thing's heavy. <laughs> well, you're making it look good. Keep it rolling. <laughs> Don't drop it now. Hey. You lose the ollies. No pressure. It's all yours. <laughs> all right. Where do we go, over here? Oh, yeah. Thank you, buddy. Yeah. Be be, baby. Behind the scenes, so normally people don't get to see inside the judges' area. This is Danny. He's the boss. Unless my sister decides she's the boss. That's true. There we go, man. <laughs> yeah, please. So we got a kid's cute See that? See that? Yeah, we will.
Is this that uh, turkey you were talking about this morning? Yes, sir. This is going to be a turkey Monte Cristo. Monte Cristo. Yes, sir. And instead of frying it, I'm brushing it with egg batter and putting it on the hot skillet. All right. Just get it on there. Good. Now, is this for uh, fun or for competition? This is the comp. Move my washer over here, honey. It's not real steady on there. That's fine. I got it. Tell me what you're doing. I'm making a Monte Cristo, brushing it with an egg mixture versus dipping it, just because brioche bun will really absorb it and make it a little too mushy. On my test run, that was my experience. So we're gonna let that cook. So this is the real deal, this is not a test run. No, sir, this is the real deal. McCoy. Watch out, there's Carl. Carl, watch out. I mean, watch out, there's Brad. Demolition <laughs> Look at that waterfront property. Yeah, that is, yeah, pretty intense. Yes, so what if we what if we start with the two of y'all kind of looking, talking about, well, this was where we were going to do the mm -hmm. stage at. We had a little water this morning, but hey, we're, this, at the shed, we roll, you know, whatever y'all want to say. The and then, must go up. And then we could, uh, I don't know if there's anything back this way to right walk behind, over to. Right behind those tents, yeah. looking this way, you can see the stage folded out, and you can see that in the back. Ooh. This is just big water right here. You want to go over here? That's actually not. That, that's a better because you have a visual with the height of the water with the tables too. And the banners. Yeah. 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 Let's go over here then. No. You don't have. So frame up where you see them, and then the stage area in the background. See the stage? You might need to be over here. Oh, that's the stage. Yeah, I was wondering where the stage is. Give you a cue. Make it about a minute and a half to two minutes, not too long. And then, like at the end, do a wrap up. Remember the, the showdown, the awards tonight. See, so some kind of wrap up where we know you're done, and then we can cut it right there. Cool. And right when you finish, just stay looking at the camera and stay filming for a little bit longer. the Shed Barbecue and Blues Joint. This weekend is our Shed Showdown, where we have six categories. Everybody's competing in multiple. We got ribs, turkey, steak, steak, steak. and rain. And Bloody Marys. And rain. <laughs> and check out the stage where we were gonna do the awards. <laughs> See that? Look at it. It's nice and smooth. Yes. <laughs> the problem is it's about two foot of water, people. Yeah. Uh, I mean, it's like rain or shine or apparently a flood. I mean, if you look over here, we lost like half of the tents. <clears throat> Not a good scenario for some of the competitors, but we grabbed, uh, everybody showed up. That's right. 
everybody went underwater. Let me tell you something about people that compete in the food arena, especially the barbecuers and the grillers. We will grill and we will slow and low smoke and compete in any kind of weather. <laughs> so it has not stopped everybody. Everybody's spirits are high. And listen, don't forget that at the end of the night, we've got the ultimate showdown where six competitors are going to go head to head in a chop style uh, cook off. We're going to be having it on Facebook Live at the Shed's Facebook page. So you guys don't forget to tune in. We're thinking it's probably going to be around 7 o'clock. And you can watch the awards and then straight into the showdown. So don't forget. Hey, we've even got a little band going to be on the stage with us doing a little wee <laughs> today and we are performing on the stage this is gonna be creepy but, my, but I have a little stage right my brothers have a lot so they're not singing I'm singing uh, yep okay because I'm Anne from the Lost Boys we're gonna be going on stage and playing all guitars well my guitar is broken for some reason it doesn't work you have the I want you all to give the judges, yourself, our partners, the hosts, the volunteers, all of you deserve a round of applause. It is free beer, thanks to Bud Light. It's down by the bayou. Um, we're gonna do the showdown after the awards. So I would suggest grabbing a cold one, and then once we get done with the awards, we're gonna start the showdown, but we're also gonna have a little break in there to go drink some more of the beer. Because it's free. It's free beer, people. Everybody give yourselves and the partners or another round of applause, and we're gonna get rolling with who's winning here. Job. I mean, you did an amazing job. And I love that it's the next generation rocking it. Yes. So, we have some gifts for all of you. What we have is a really cool swag bag from B&B Charcoal. We have an awesome cup just for you from Yeti. It's pretty cool. And then we also have an awesome swag bag from Cheaper Copper Seasonings. So, and Alton really wanted to be here. He hates that he's missing it because he just loves to see you guys 
do your thing over the grill. So we've got lots of love for you. We're going to start passing it down, and then I'm going to hand the mic over to Kim, and he's going to start calling numbers to see who's going to go home with money and uh, and the grill. So on first place, I'll talk about that once you call it. What first place? Yeah! Let's give him a big hand. Make sure you get some cash from these guys over there. Over to Mr. Dean. All right. Seventh place. Ticket number 6078. 78. What'd you cut? Good answer. What kind of rock did you use?
guys are sweating and it's like 68 degrees out here. Uh, well, I'm sweating. Watch it. Just a hassle. I mean, what do you think? I mean, you, you good? You good? Yeah? Yeah? I, don't know. I like it. I like it. So in the PKs, um, our, our, our friends and our very good friends here with uh, B&B Charcoal, they built a two-zone two fire, basically, an indirect and a direct on the charcoal. Now, these competitors can choose to spread that out and go even on the heat or keep it indirect. And, of course, we're using the grill grates because they have such beautiful, just beautiful markings. But you got to realize the grill grates, and all these guys know this. What's your idea? For those of you watching um, out there, everybody in this crowd that competes probably knows this already. Grill grates will raise that temperature about 100 degrees, which is good and nice sear marks. But it also reduces the flare up which is great as well. Um, but I, I, I see well, everybody I see Rocky Roll like, like what, juicing something out. What, what was it? I mean, you... Oh, oh, I see. Oh, All right. no, you so didn't. Did. Hey, can we get a time check over here on this TV? Johnny Joseph, give me a time check. 16 minutes, 18, 17, 16 seconds. You guys are rock and rolling. Everybody looks real calm and collective on the outside, yeah. but we're all fired up on the inside. I love it. I love the camaraderie. I love the fierce competition, and I love the fierce friendship. Hey, where are Ricky Bobby? Ricky Bobby, Ricky Bobby, right here. Ricky Bobby, we're getting into that uh, like 15 minute mark on these turn-ins. So uh, number one thing that we want to make sure that the temperature is right. Yeah.